Hello, welcome to Biogrid TV. If you're new here, please subscribe and turn on the notification so you don't miss our next video. Biography of Hezekiah Oladipo Davies Chief Hezekiah Oladipo Davies, also known as HOD, was a leading nationalist, founder, lawyer, journalist, trade unionist, and politician who was part of the Nigerian independence struggle between 1950 and 1960. Here's a man whose blood bleeds royalty as his maternal grandfather was the Oba, that is king of Efon Alaye. His maternal great-grandmother was the Owa, that is queen regent of the Elisha kingdom. His grandmother was Princess Hastrop, the daughter of the Ijesha monarch, and his paternal grandfather was Prince Ogumade Davies, son of King Dosumu, 1823-1885, of the Ogumade ruling house of Lagos. His father, known as Spiritual Moses, was one of the founding fathers of the Cherubim and Seraphim Church of Nigeria, was born on the 5th of April, 1905, in the western city of Lagos, Nigeria. As a boy, he started school life at Wesley School, Olowogbowo, Lagos, between 1911 and 1917, proceeded to Methodist Boys High School, Lagos, between 1917 and 1920. In 1921, he went to King's College in Lagos till 1923, where he finished his secondary school. Within a short period, Providence smiled at him as he went on to become assistant master at King's College, Lagos. Truth be told, Davy's thirst for education is something overwhelming, as it could be likened to the Oliver Twist yearn for more. He became one of the very first Nigerian admitted to the distance learning program in the University of London, as he had previously passed the London matriculation examination in 1925. On the same pace, he applied to study at the London School of Economics in 1935, where he graduated with Bachelor of Commerce with honors. Davis' legacies at the institution will never be forgotten as he was elected president of the Cosmopolitan Club, president of the West African Student Union, WASU, and representative of the University of London in the Executive Committee on British Universities. In 1937, he returned to Nigeria to become the manager of the Daily Service, a leading newspaper outlet. By 1944, Davies took up another challenge to go study law in London, where he came out in flying colors and was immediately called to the English Bar, the Temple Inns of Court in London, 1946. Before his educational height, he, alongside some notable Nigerians, Kofo Abayomi, James Churchill Vaughan, Ernest Sise Ikoli, and Samuel Akinsoya, formed the team that established the Lagos Youth Movement, LYM, in 1934. He, however, served as the Secretary General of the Youth Movement, which was one of the earliest political associations encouraging Nigerians to actively participate in the political and socio-economic development of their country. By the time Davis returned from his studies abroad alongside his childhood friend, Namdi Azikiwe in 1950. With his vast experience, he and Azikiwe formed an alliance to transform the Lagos youth movement, which looked more like a tribal group. It was reformed, expanded and renamed Nigerian Youth Movement NYM, which made both individuals become more prominent members, contributors and national leaders with mass followers. Having done that, Davies finally decided to part ways with the Nigerian Youth Movement in 1951 and went on to establish his own party, the Nigerian People's Congress NPC. Quite unfortunate, his party couldn't stand the prowess of the action group in western Nigeria led by Awolowo. Davies then merged his new party with the National Council of Nigeria and Cameroons NCNC in 1953. 
Chief Hezekiah Oladipo Davies went on to become a very successful lawyer, being one of the very first two Nigerians, along with Chief Frederick Rotimi Williams, that were honored with the distinction of Queen's Council in 1959. It's on record that Davies was the only African lawyer among the legal team that helped defend Jomo Kenyatta before the British Court Council during the famous Mau Mau uprising, seeing to the release of their client, Jomo Kenyatta, on the 14th of August, 1961. In 1960, Chief Hezekiah Oladipo Davies was appointed as the founding chairman and managing director of the Nigerian National Press publishers of the Nigerian Morning Post and Sunday Post under the watch of the Prime Minister, Sir Abubakar Tafawa Balewa. Nonetheless, his good work soon earned him the appointment of the Federal Minister of State in the Ministry of Industries during Nigeria's First Republic from 1963 to 1966. HOD spearheaded the group of Nigerian delegates that went to the Economic Council at the United Nations in 1964 to foster good economic relations with other foreign countries. Afterwards, he was knighted by the French government, Chevalier de l'Ordre National du Mérite, that is, National Order of Merit, in September 1974 for promoting good interrelations between French and Nigeria and his vital contribution as the managing director of both the Total Fina Oil and Elf Petroleum. A brief through Chief Hezekiah Oladipo Davis's accomplishments. He was a national president of the World Peace Through Law, president of the United Nations Organization in Nigeria, chairman of the Rotary Club of Nigeria, and also the founder president of the Nigerian France Friendship Association. His notable childhood friends, who became very successful and played vital roles to the development of Nigeria, were the first president of Nigeria, Dr. Namdi Azikiwe, the first indigenous chief justice of the federation, Sir Adetokumbo Ademola, and Dr. Oni Akerele. Davis remained an ardent Christian despite his involvement in politics and other social activities, which seems to be against the backdrop of Christianity. He was a Wesleyan, a Methodist and a strong believer as he was actively engaged in ministries involving welfare for the poor and the needy and always seeking cooperation among all Christian denominations. He finally died in his home on the 22nd of November 1989 in Lagos, Nigeria. Prior to his death, his autobiography, Memoirs, was published early in 1989. What have we missed out of this biography of H. O. Davies? Let's know in the comment section. Will it be ridiculous to subscribe to our channel? If no, please like this video, share and subscribe to our channel.